So this picture was taken March 13th which was the first day of the big quarantine. Um, we were told the day before that our season was canceled and it was supposed to be senior night that Friday. So we decided to come in for one more day and do a little celebration for them. Um, clearly we didn't know what social distancing was at that point. So the next day I made my way to New Roads, Louisiana, which is where my boyfriend is from. And that's where I spent most of my quarantine, which I thought was super fun, but I'm not sure he'd say the same if you'd ask him. Um, my dog and I got to lay out a bunch of the days, which was really fun and relaxing. I obviously still had school to do, and clearly that didn't go as planned with my dog, but I got it done. My teammates and I did a few Zoom calls because we missed each other so much. We got to hang out on False River. My friend and I also did some volunteer work. So here I was trying to do that challenge where you take your sweatpants off while you're still in a handstand and that really did not go how I planned. And then it was the big draft night. We were so freaking excited. It was such a cool experience for him and I was just super, super proud of him. And then the next day we were back on False River. I actually caught a fish, but I was terrified to hold it. I also drove to BR a few times to hang out with my friends. We took a bunch of walks on the levee. I also got to hang out with some of my best friends that I miss so much. They were at home for a few weeks and they finally came back, which was really fun. But then... I'm sure you all know what this is. I was getting COVID tested because a few weeks later I started showing symptoms and two days later the test came back and it was actually positive. Here's me waving at my boyfriend from the door since I couldn't see him. The only time I could go outside was to take my dog out. I stayed in my room most of the time. I actually tried to do a workout. Here's me and I literally almost died because I couldn't breathe. Bad idea. A few days later, I was released and you know the first place I went was the nail salon. I went on a fishing trip with my boyfriend bright and early. The sunrise was so pretty, but y'all, it was so hot. Then the next day, I finally felt it was safe enough to fly home and see my parents. I hadn't been home in like a few months, so that was super fun. I got to bring my dog home. He flew for the first time, and he was so good. Right when I got home, we had a little visitor, and he was limping. We were so sad. I got to see my best friend, who I only see a few times out of the year because she's also a gymnast at the University of Florida. Then PQ flew home to see me in New Jersey because he missed me so much. And then it was time for PQ to report to Baltimore. So my mom drove PQ and I, and I stayed there with him for about a week. And then it was time for me to go back to Jersey, which was super duper sad, but I got to hang out at the Jersey shore for a little bit with my family. And then finally I made my way back to Baton Rouge. And that is what I'm gonna count as the end of my quarantine.